so I'm Maria Hanok. I'm the program manager of the Swedish Institute's uh, program She Entrepreneurs, which is a leadership training that we are running for female entrepreneurs coming from eight different countries in the Middle East and North Africa. Uh, what they all have in common is that they have started businesses with a, with a ambition to contribute to social or environmental impact in their country. Yeah, so this year we've uh, delivered the program as a hybrid program, meaning that we have been working together both online and on-site here in Stockholm. So we started uh, already in uh, April online uh, with uh, workshops and uh, meetups, uh, uh, both in larger and smaller groups. Focus has been on um, supporting the participants in, in growing their turnover and operations. We've been focusing on leadership and team development and then of course also to increasing impact, both social and environmental impact from the businesses. My name is Ruth Brenman. I'm the founder of Impact Invest Scandinavia and we are a partner of She Entrepreneur Program in the Swedish Institute. To me it's quite important with the emphasis on women and the she entrepreneurs because after all, after so many years of working in this field of entrepreneurship, I still see that women entrepreneurs with high potential for growth in their businesses and really contribute to economic growth in different countries don't get the same funding as male entrepreneurs do. And why is that? Is it because women do not seem to be risk-taking? Is it because we're not presenting these grand plans? But you know, I'm also a researcher. And research tells us that women companies, they might grow a little bit more slowly, but become as profitable as this bold, ambitious plan that we often see from tech companies, for example. So there is such value in putting women in focus when it comes to entrepreneurship, because that really contributes to so many values being developed in society.